Did you get in touch with Adam? Yeah, he'll be here. Is that everybody? The entire family. We can start calling the other people now. Actually, it's not the entire family. What do you mean? Mom left to tell Iris. Iris? Iris, you better not come over here tonight. Amanda, that'll be up to Mom. I don't ever want to see her again. And I don't think she should be allowed to come to the service. She'll be okay. Yeah. Excuse me. I guess I made a real fool out of myself in there, huh? Amanda, your father just died. You can act any way you want to. He would have been here with us. I could have said goodbye if it wasn't for her. I'm not so sure that's true. I should be thinking about Daddy, you know? I mean, would he want me to act like this? Well, he wouldn't want you to pretend you weren't angry. He was mad at Iris, too. What she did was unforgivable. Amanda, look, that is just not important right now. What's important is how you feel. I'll be okay. I just need some time to myself. Look, I'm going to go check up on Allie, so if you need me, I'll be in the nursery. when your mother and I bought this for you. Dad. I was like a maniac, buying everything in sight. Rachel said, that's it. I don't want that baby expecting a windfall every Christmas. Then she saw the bear. Well, Christmas wouldn't be Christmas without Theodore under the tree. Yeah, he was bigger than you then. You were just a baby. Next Christmas, I'll have my own baby. That's been a wonderful father. Oh. I know I've really caused you a lot of trouble. Oh, no, you haven't. Well, of course, you did have quite a knack for getting <laughs> into things. Darling, no, you've been nothing but a joy to your mother and me. You're a very, very special person to us. Yeah, I came as soon as I heard it. I'm so sorry. You've never disappointed me, Amanda. No. And I never will. I'll always be here for you, Dad. Thanks, Daddy. Let's get you married, sweetheart. Goodbye. Thank you. Amanda was really upset about Iris. Yeah, she needs someone to blame. And I can understand the feeling. I know Iris did something really awful. But now seems like a time to forgive. Maybe later. I hope so. What Iris did really hit Amanda harder than anybody else. Not just what she did to Mac. But she pretended to be Amanda's friend, her loving sister. The whole bit. Their whole relationship was one big lie. If you think about it. So was our relationship. From the first day, you told me you were pregnant. 